What's up guys, Chris is the Games here, and today Chris is back with more Pocket Trains for you. Before you, before you jump into that, I want to acknowledge that over the weekend, about Friday, late after, late morning, early afternoon or so, we reached 100 subscribers. Guys, 100 subscribers. That means 100 people, well over 100 now, 100 people have seen my content and liked it enough and created it and have a YouTube channel and chosen to be notified whenever a new video comes out because they just love watching my videos and that makes me feel so happy inside guys thank you so much it means a lot to me I remember back when I had uh, some very small amount of subscribers like it was just the guys I associate with and I was on the Minecraft Zaka website and I saw YouTube mode and I'm like oh cool YouTube mode I want to get that I want YouTube and I said they had to get a hundred subscribers and I'm like oh man hundred subscribers I don't know if I'm ever going to get there, man, that's that's a lot of subscribers, but here we are right now, guys, and I want to thank you so much for it. Um, I believe we're at 103 right now, um, but let's go over our comments we got over the weekend. Um, before we do that, though, I want to mention again that I have not filmed, or not again, but I have not filmed the 100 sub video yet, um, so if you want to be in that, it's not too late, send me an email with 100 in the subject the number 100, 1 and followed by two zeros, and then your Skype name in the uh, message along with, along with if you want to put something else like I want to be in your video, you can put that in too, it doesn't really matter, but put your Skype name in there, and subject 100, send it to chrisasthegames at gmail.com, also if you want a gift from me through Pocket Trains, send me your gift code in the email with the subject title, Pocket Trains gift code, just like that, how you see it on screen, and I will very promptly send you a part. Um, ask anyone who already has and they will tell you. Also, YouTube comments. Okay, here we go. Come on. I have not um, skimmed through these in advance, so I'm just going to show them all, but just mention the ones that I think are worth mentioning. Um, also, I have not gotten the uh, my headphone, new headphones yet. But man, they're so close I can almost taste them. I, I'm definitely probably going to get them um, later today. If, by the time you're watching this, get probably I might, may already have them. But uh, ooh, something I also want to mention: over the weekend, I was doing some live stream testing, and I got it to work with about a 10 to 15 minute delay. Wow, that's a lot. So that's all those. If you saw the videos over the weekend, I had a test of one through four. Um, test one never even made it. Test two and three were tests, and test four is a test. I kept up test four, so you can still check my channel and see that there. There's really nothing exciting at all. I, if you go, if you want to see it, know what it's about. Just read the comment that I left from there, and that'll explain it. Uh, when I do have an official live stream, I will let you guys know, and I may need some people to help me test out a live stream also to see how long of a delay you guys get. Um, but yeah, so Syndicate Junk Challenge. I've been doing that, um, yeah, and uh, that's going. Second episode out soon, hopefully. Um, also, why Sims 3, someone asked. Um, first off, I feel like I do, or I will be doing Minecraft a lot with the Syndicate Chunk Challenge, and I do Pocket Trains week daily, and so uh, Sims 3, that's where I feel I'm lacking. If you guys have something else you want me to do, let me know. Um, I was thinking of doing Minecraft, um, just some Hunger Games or something during the stream, um, but you know, nothing really big. It'd be mainly Sims 3. Uh, thanks, Scott, for your support on Sims and Pocket Trains. Um, thanks, guys, for the subscriptions again. Also, there's something else I wanted to say, but I forgot what it was. Um, Pocket Planes, let's play. I want to wait on that for now. Um, once Pocket Trains kind of dies out for me and I lose that excitement that I had from the beginning, um, then I will um, take up Pocket Planes. And since I'll be doing Pocket Trains and Pocket Planes, neither of those will be daily. Uh oh, what's this? Oh, neither of those will be daily. So it'll be like alternating or something. But, uh,. Let's see, I think we've seen these comments already. So, with that said, we'll just move into Pocket Trains. Let's see. 
it would be seven days ago. Sending an email, I got the email. Okay, so if I remember, if I remember what I want to talk about, I'll bring it up. But for now, I do not remember. So uh, yeah, post more more MC Ricky. I will with a new Syndicate Chunk Challenge coming out. Also, I just put up uh, the second playthrough of the Dark Age server with the Cloud Crew, and uh, you can check that out on my channel. So let's get into Pocket Trains. There we go. I like how it automatically just switches over. So let's move this here out of our way. Man, guys, I, I, I want to say thank you a lot. Every time I open my phone, and I swear this is like every single time I open my pocket trains, I get new parts coming in. Thanks a bunch, guys. Um, again, you know how to get stuff back from me if you want. So, yeah. Let's, um... Also, oh, I remember what I want to say now. So I feel like my thing here has turned into more of a uh, Kurt J. Mac Farlands or Bust thing. If you have not seen that, search Farlands or Bust forwards on YouTube and uh, that will take you to that and uh, yeah that'll take you there and you can check that out because I feel like, like it's more of less of a let's play now uh, I'm still let's playing but it's less of a let's play let's play and more of a daily vlog slash daily update video on what I'm doing um, so this looks like it's gonna be taking a while this is a lot of lag. I'm gonna um, do some stuff and I'll be right back with you guys once we hopefully get that fixed. Okay, we're back. I figured it out um, it's probably just my network problems. Again, it's because of my network problems also that I have a really bad live stream capability on my channel, uh, which is why the delay is like 15 some odd minutes. Wait, I didn't want to click on that. No, don't, don't, aw, oh, come on. Come on, phone. I didn't want to click on that ad. Back to pocket trains. There we go. So, um,. Yeah, live streaming will hopefully happen soon. Oh, also, um, the new series I'm doing, it's gonna be coming out soon. I've already filmed it. I just need, where's the train at? There it is. I've already filmed it. I just need to get the, uh, get it edited and put it out for you guys. That should happen very soon, if not already. Cause, uh, yeah. And, you know, with filming a whole hour, or one whole day early, not really sure what's already happened, but, I'm sure that it will happen soon, whatever it is, because I lost whatever we're talking about. Yay for paying attention, right? Uh, uh, can we take these both? We can. Sure can. You guys have no clue what I'm doing right now because the lag is so bad. Um, let me know down in the comments, guys. Let me know down below. Is having all this lag on here really worth it for you guys? I mean, it seems more of a thing where you can just watch this video and have something watching in the background because there's not really uh, any exciting video on here. This is just my opinion though. Um, you can be reading a comic or going on something and not even be watching my video and uh, which I mean I'm not complaining or advocating but you know uh, what do you guys think? I mean because if need be we can just push this to its own thing or I give daily update vlogs on what's going on course they'll be a lot shorter because I won't feel as obligated to do record as much because I won't be playing a game but uh, let me know what you think down below guys um, should this just be its own daily vlog thing instead of uh, pairing it with with pocket trains or is this good that I'm putting it with pocket trains even though it's really laggy so that you guys have something to watch while I'm doing this um, so yeah tell me down below Please let me know about that, that's probably one of the most important things I'm asking you to do, because that could change a lot on this channel. Um, if you haven't already guys, check out my Syndicate Chunk Challenge videos down below, no, I won't put a link, you can find it on my channel. Um, 
because there's stuff going on there that I'm sure you would like to see. And it's really interesting, I'm having a lot of fun. I don't usually do survival a lot, but... Uh, whoa! Can we, did we get that? No, we did not get that crate. Dang it. Um, don't usually do survival a lot, so it's interesting for me to take that up again. Let's look at our stats real quickly. Oh, boom. Here's that. You can see yesterday I didn't really play at all. Um, menu bank. Here's the exchange, 330, so it's saying up there pretty good. Um, let's look at today's event. Tourists are flocking to Volgograd to see the world's largest paperclip. Help the city handle the new burst of tourism. Deliver 75 jobs, yada yada yada. With the time left, you can guess what time I'm reporting this. <laughs> um, let's not open a crate because we have no stuff, but look at the engines we have. Yeah, look at the engines we have. Um, for those of you wondering, and there's probably a very, very small amount of you, if anybody at all, wondering how I'm getting the live stream stuff out, it's a lot more complicated than I thought. Let's just say that. I'm on a Mac, so I use CamTwist. Um, you can Google search that, CamTwist. And, uh, sure, let's purchase a crate. Why not? No, let's not purchase a crate. We can't, we don't have the box to open it. Um, I do use CamTwist on Mac to edit my video, or to, uh, not edit, but to switch between video s sources, and I use Adobe Media Live Encoder to get it to YouTube. Um, so yeah, you can check that out by searching it in Google. Here is our XP progress right now. Boom, there it is. And uh, something I've also been doing lately, guys, is I was watching The Fox, and uh, don't worry, it's not my first time, I've, I've been keeping up to date on stuff, but uh, Ilvis on the TV Norge channel on YouTube has a lot of great stuff. I mean, I don't think they get a lot of recognition for it too, but I just want to say to all probably within a week total, about 50 of you who are going to watch this video, um, I just want to say to check out um, Ilvis' Elvis, stuff. Uh, one, of, one of my favorite stuff that has, that has me like laughing, I was falling over on my chair is the Intellivator. Um, that's pretty fun stuff. So check that out guys if you haven't already because it's cool and they're pretty funny guys too and they have some pretty good songs out like Massachusetts is one of my favorite. Stonehenge. There's some good stuff out there so check that out guys. And with that I don't think I'm forgetting anything pocket trains wise or comments wise. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you leave a like and drop a comment down below and tell me about stuff that I asked you to tell me about. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys like this. I'm gonna repeat myself. I don't want to do that. Um, let's leave with a look at the map we have. Wow, it's getting big enough where we can't zoom to see all of it. But, uh, leave a like and drop a comment down below, guys, if you liked it. And if you really like it and you definitely want to see more, just got bucks from something. If, you're, if you want to see more, definitely subscribe and you will definitely see more of this. Remember, Chris is the games, and Chris will see you guys next time. Also, let me know what you think about the episode length.